recently, Kaylee did a uh, review on the Nocilicast talking about how aggravated she is that she has to throw away her perfectly functioning AirPods because the batteries don't work anymore. So I hunted down a company called Akuva that is working on headphones with replaceable batteries, but this isn't a headphone that's like the size of a small piece of bread. Exactly. We are so I'm with like Amy, Amy Jackson right now. Yeah. So we're more the size of a pea. So we can solve that battery problem. We have something called a hot swap battery. So what it happens is when you are wearing your earbud device and after about four or five hours when the battery is going dead and you're just into a phone call, all you have to do is quickly pop out the battery. In your charging case right here, you have additional batteries, which I'm sorry, wasn't ready for this, uh, that you would just take out. You would put in your dead one. Put this back in. It takes about 15 seconds when you get good at it, and you're back on. You are off for no more than 15 seconds, and you have enough battery life for about. Turn your head this way, Turn your head this way so he can no, the other side. Oh, <laughs> sorry. So the the uh, these earpods are very small. They're they're almost flush with her her ear, and they're not much bigger than the ear canal there. No, you're absolutely right, and the reason is is because. Most earbuds, the retention comes from the outside of the ear canal. That's why they're so big and bulky. But ours, uh, given our patented comfort seals, we have probably the deepest uh, uh, penetration, penetration into the yeah. Yeah, uh, retention that you can get. And then we have these wonderful comfort seals that when you take them off, She's Sorry. pulling it off right now. It's three yeah, sort of he, uh, it's three sort of flanges that are that are yeah. holding on to her ear there. So when you look at this tri-tier uh, seal, I don't know if you can see it from here, but they are vented, so you'll never feel occluded. Oh, I like that. Well, yeah. And then it has um, a built-in wax guard, which is also wonderful, so wax will not get in the receiver. And then you just put, you know, change them for sanitary reasons when you need to and then you just pop it back in your ear. So the reason we can be so small is because our retention comes from within the ear canal, not the, not on the, out, the outside part. And then the th one other thing we have that's really awesome is we have a built-in bone conduction mic. Oh, yeah. okay. So when you're on a call, say in a room like this, we are 100% noise canceled. You will not hear anything in the background. Because the microphone is only the bone conduction. It's only the bone conduction hearing through jaw. So we have some pretty unique stuff. And for the traveler, we have a voice translation, which is real time. Oh, come on. Yep. Nope. Real deal. Wow. And we're also um, really going for a market of about 20 through 55, 60. And we want to address people who have mild hearing loss. So this same device, there is an amp where they can do an in-situ hearing test with this in their ear. It'll burn their thresholds to the device and they will get that volume and nobody will know if they're wearing an amplifier or a wearable. Oh, that is really, really cool. Yeah, I like did want to think we're forward, forward thinking here. I do want to say for the audio listeners that the case that she was describing where she's got the earbuds in the case, but then she flipped the bottom of it open to get to the spare batteries. And the spare batteries will be kept in here. And are they charging when they're in yeah. the case? So oh, so they it's charging, charging on one side and on the other side at the Correct. same time. Wow. Yeah, so the, the case is not that much bigger than an AirPods case. Not at all, no. One so, side device, the other side batteries charging. Wow. And Apple says it can't be done. Uh, it can't be done. <laughs> we did So it. the name of the company is Akuva. What's the name of the product? Uh, it's the, uh, the product's name is also Akuva. Uh, it's actually the Akuva Extreme with the hot swap battery. And the Akuva Amp is for the amplifier. Oh, that is really cool. So uh, we are in Eureka Park. Do you have an idea of when this is going to come to market? Uh, yeah, we're hoping for Q2, Q3. Oh, and really? Of this year? Yeah, we're very. We're almost done. It's oh, almost done. fantastic. I really, uh, I really yeah. wish you guys a lot of luck. This Thank is you. a cool product. Thank you very much. Oh yeah. Do you have a price point yet? Uh, the Akuva amp is going for five hundred dollars uh, on sale here for three fifty for pre-orders, and the Akuva Extreme. How much is that? Uh, He's asking a colleague, 250. right? 250. 250. So, so the amp is actually another physical device. No, it's the same device. It's just with the, uh, you are actually just getting the app with it to increase the thresholds. Do I got you. I got you. I thought you had to buy both, and that was no. starting to get real expensive. No, okay. Not at okay. all. So if you need the hearing amplification, you get the, the uh, Akuva amp. You get the Akuva Extreme if you don't. Exactly. All right. I, I caught up. Thank yeah. you very much, Amy. This is really, really cool. Thank you. Thank you.